to share my thoughts on the Passion of the Christ. So the film covers the final 12 hours of Jesus' death, consisting of the Passion, his title of the film. The film starts with Jesus' agony in the garden, in the garden of Gethsemane, the betrayal of Judas Iscariot, brutal scourging of the pillar, the suffering of Mary, as prophesied by the prophet Simeon, the crucifixion and death of Jesus. However, the film ends with a brief depiction of Jesus' resurrection. The film has flashbacks to particular moments in Christ's life, in which are biblically, biblically based, such, on, such as the Lost Supper and the Seven on the Mountain, and others that are artistically licensed when Mary comforts Jesus and the scene where Jesus crabbing tables. It was for the most part shot in Italy. The dialogue is entirely in Hebrew, Latin, and reconstructed Aramaic. Although Gibson was entirely against it, the film was subtitled. However, I give this film 10 out of 10 because they have the best music the best flagellation, the best Jesus whipping scene that I saw, although it was many offensive to some people, I watched it, I saw how Jesus died for our sins, and the star who portrayed Jesus would be Jim Caviezel. That's right. How did he star in The Passion of Christ? Well, Jim Caviezel, had gotten the role of Jesus in the Passion of the Christ. However, when he was on the cross, he was struck by lightning. He was lit up like a Christmas tree. But Jim Caviezel has suffered pneumonia uh, during the scene on the cross. In the filming, he was 158, but his actual weight was 230 pounds. In the filming, he was 168 pounds. That's why he was suffering up there. Oh, Jim? Oh, he suffered there. He really suffered on the cross. Yes, I know I reviewed the DVD already, but the DVD was good. It, it included the recut version of the film, basically. And the sequel to The Passion of the Christ, it's coming. Absolutely coming. So, that was my thoughts on The Passion of the Christ movie. Oh yeah, I gave the Passion of Christ movie 10 out of 10. The film's got good performance. The film's got good ratings. You should watch it. I recommend you watching it. But due to the film being rated R, you should not recommend tiny children to watch it. Because it will be not good to your children. So thank you guys for watching.